I ain't never been too good with waking up. I don't know if anybody is, though. I bet some people just jump the hell up, run to the kitchen looking for Wheaties or some shit. Where the fuck are my Wheaties? Damn, I had to wake up early for a study group. For my urban politics class. Lord of mercy, what does that even mean? Black, poor, unclassified? Ain't that a bitch. By the way, my name is Faith, and I gotta go. I hate being late. Everybody looks up at you like you spray painted the reason on your shirt. Public service announcement. I didn't stay up trying to make a million dollars for you. So the way I figure, y'all just breaking your necks because I'm cute. share really they only put 15 chips in these little ass 99 cent bags so what i'm gonna do give out a chip per person call it high tea ha i don't think so miss breakfast putting them away well i was assuming that you're just finishing breakfast but anyway leave it alone saying let's just assign tasks well since me and faith are off campus you think we can do the project together um, did Joe just volunteer to work with me? Well, as a leader. He kind of fine, and I definitely don't want to work with Abby. Man, I know this Ivy League Barbie is not finna have this shit. I approve. So, Joe and Faith will be in charge of the video part. Okay, great. I gotta run. We're not done yet. Well, Abby, I am. I gotta work at one. Faith will catch me up. I sure will catch you up, this fine white man. The way he told her off? Mm, sexy. All right, Celia, you have chapters one through five, okay. and Roman chapters six through ten. All right. And since no one seems to give a fuck, meeting's done. Shit works for me. I'll email you. All right. By the way, Faith, you're coming with me to get that book. Damn. So much for avoiding Abby. Have a. Abby, can I can I ask you a question? This is kind of a silly question, but it's a question. So. Y yeah, what's up? Um, you know Joe, <laughs> Joe, Joe. Yeah, so um, he's he's cute. Like he's he's like a good looking guy. He's he's cute, right? Yeah, he's attractive, I guess. Yeah, he's he's good looking. I mean, you're not the best of friends, but he's like handsome, right? Wait. Do you like Joe? Fuck. Think fast. Abby, it's been 15 minutes. Like, the book's not here. Fuck. I hate when I forget who I'm talking to and then say something stupid like how I Do feel. Like Are you gonna fucking Joe? Abby. Come on. Tell me. You can, you can tell me. Do you like him? Abby. Honestly, for a white boy, he's cute. A white boy? Faith, don't fool yourself. Do you actually think he's into you? I mean, yeah, I mean, well, he might not like big girls. <laughs> well, that too. But, uh, let's just say you're not his type. Not his type? <laughs> you mean white? Abby, you're you, Joe's Joe, and I'm me. <laughs> what the fuck did I just say? When college gets overwhelming, this is my getaway. Hi, Nana. Faith, come on in. Oh, hi, sweetheart. Oh my gosh, it's so good to see you. Mm. <laughs> this whole identity thing's been bothering me all day. So I had to ask her. Like, when I was little, did, did people, you know, were they questioning, like, what was I? Or like, why are you my grandmother? Was I adopted? And like, you know, like, did you deal with any problems because of that? Because of the color difference? Yeah. Um, I like to think of it as, like, coffee with cream. Your father was white and your mom was black and you're a beautiful color. Yeah. You're right. I, I, sometimes... look, look, look at my color. Is that beautiful? Purple. Brown. Yellow. 
I mean, I look at me. Now look at yours. Put your arms out. Now which color would you rather be? Let's be honest. Look at how beautiful that is. I like look at this. I like your freckles though. <laughs> I don't. I'll trade you. <laughs> no. Thanks, Nana. I guess no one's really white or black. Well, you're a mixture of both, and I'm sure it's difficult, but that means you're the best. That, that's why our country's so great, because we're a mixture. You're the best. I'm sure it's harder to get used to. Yeah. And a little puzzling, but you just be proud of yourself, because you are the best. I love you. How about much? Yeah. Let's go. All right, let's move in. She always did know how to choose her words. But for now, Nana's blue eyes can't give me a white pass. Funny thing, I ain't never want one. God doesn't care about white or black. For you formed my inner parts. You covered me in my mother's womb. I will praise you, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are your works, and that my soul knows very well, when I was made in secret, and skillfully wrought in the lowest parts of the earth. Your eyes saw my substance being yet unformed, and in your book, they all were written, the days fashioned for me, when as yet there was none of them. For me. I was perfectly made. I don't know why I let it get to me. Why do you let it get to you, Faith? I'm not black. I'm not white. I mean, I'm just me.